Hello everyone! For this video is going to be gameplay as well as giving QR codes of the old lunars. So if you're looking for the raid lunar QR, you gotta we gotta wait some time later. Not on this video. I'm saying that now, so that way people don't have to say, "Oh, well, I clicked on the thing and you didn't say that you were not giving the thing." That's why the titles always will have old lunar QRs. We're gonna be taking a look at Raid Lunar L6. This is in collab with Cypress, so make sure you check out Cypress, show them some love. So going over part by part, we have got our lair, which is Raid Lunar L6. I suspect it will not have uh, metal on it. I'm not too sure how useful Raid will be. I, I think Zone in this case would probably be better. Uh, we have our disc, which is 3A-D, so they did do the 3A disc. Uh, 3A as a disc form, so that is pretty cool. I suspect, no, uh, it'll probably be better than even the TT Drake and the Hasbro Drake, just considering. It's like a bigger shape and weight and everything. Uh, Destroyer SPM. So the Speedstorm tips uh, do not have uh, that much stamina. They uh, they do not. So really, Speedstorm tips should just be really kind of used for attack combinations. At least in my opinion, they should just kind of be used for attack combinations. So that's why I think Destroyer SPM will be good because considering what Destroyer, well, I mean, it won't have the life after death Destroyer has, but it'll definitely still be helpful for the aggressive uh, attacks. I would probably say that it'll very likely be the strongest uh, speed. Wait, let me just double check something. I, I think the app has it as Hypersphere, so. Yeah, okay, I have to go on an HS Stadium, it's really weird. I think it's gonna be probably the strongest uh, bay out of all the speed storm, just considering. I guess we have to go on a hypersphere one because it's very weird how they did it. I think that I, I feel Helios will probably still be the best uh, left surge chip, but uh, Raid will probably be pretty cool. Oh, cool, we have a left launcher too on there. Three, two, one. All right, there you go, perfect launch. So we're gonna get the orbs. Yeah, they gotta they gotta fix some things on here because it's a little bit weird that it's a hypersphere for the speed storm. I think it's just because it has the same name, probably the code got confused. Yeah, but let me know your thoughts uh, for Raid Lunar. Do you think it'll be good? How, how much do you think it'll be compared to Zone Lunar? You know, let me know. I think the bands are. In, I'm really more interested in the 3A-D disc. I, I I'm assuming you'll have the same weight as 1A and uh, 1B as a disc. So as long as it's 23, that'll be pretty good. Uh, let's do this right now. All right, so we're gonna get the orbs. Perfect. Do the attack and another point. Easy. I'm trying to think, is there anything else? I don't know if it'll be the best uh, lunar. I'm trying to think what is actually the best uh, lunar for Hasbro. I think technically it'd have to be L3. Because L4 doesn't uh, have the metal. Uh, zone. While wow, Zone is pretty good, I don't think it compares to uh, L3. And I think Raid would be the same case. But who knows, maybe we'll get surprised. Okay, we're gonna do this. Kinda wanna burst, but I don't think I'm gonna, oh! There you go, Hypersphere. Now let's, uh, let's see it go around. Yeah, that's so weird though. All right, whatever, it's cool to see. And it drops down, and boom! Awesome. We got ourselves a victory, and level up. Uh, so let's do it against uh, another bay. And again, huge shout out uh, to Cypress. Obviously, this is still like collab with him. Uh, let's do random. Let's do digital hypersphere stadium. No oh, good, Rock Tavor. I still think uh, I, I really want to try out the destroyer. That's the, really the part I'm really interested in. That in the disc, not too much the other parts. But I've already like expected this, like. Even, even if, for whatever reason, Raid did have metal, I still don't think it could be that useful. Uh, since, obviously, the whole thing that made Raid so good was the actual chassis system. But, uh, you know, who knows? 
I'm more excited for Lunar than like Devilos or Mirage. I think Devilos I'm least excited for. Fafnir is like second and obviously first is Lunar. Perfect. All right, there you go. Easy win. Round one. Okay, round two. I mean, it is pretty cool to see a battle on the app. So I was thinking of this in the comments. How good do you think Ray Lunar is going to be in general? Do you think it'll still lose badly like uh, some of the other cutter parts? Or do you think uh, it won't be too bad? And how well do you think it'll be just for Hasbro? Because obviously there are two different things. Like uh, for TT stuff, yeah, probably. Wow, you could get a burst? Oh no. I was going to say because like for, uh, you know, for Hasbro stuff, yeah, it'll probably be not too bad. But uh, in general, maybe, you know, that's a different story. I, I think it might be a little worse than Zone. That's what I'm thinking. So we're going to try to beat Rock Tavor here. It's going to get the orbs. Okay, we're going to do this. Attack. Perfect. All right, second point uh, victory. There we go. Okay, we're going to try to get the next point on this one. For attack tip C, it's very interesting because we've got exceed, exceed SPM, uh, destroyer, destroyer. I know, just destroyer SPM, and then after evolutional SP, I'm pretty sure, off memory. So we're gonna have uh, you know decent amount of options. Just gonna try to get uh, this burst on. I really want to get first, but I don't think he's gonna give it to me. I uh, didn't give it to me. All right, well, we'll do one more uh, with Raid, and then after I'll just, you know, oh, let's do the after track, eh? And uh, we'll wrap it up, exhibition, random. Stream challenges. That has, wait, is that Hypersphere? Challenger. Yeah, no, that should, hmm. All right, let me see the other ones. Old Man Contender, Chaos Core, Chaos Core, Champion Clash. Well, let's do it in this one, I like this one. Oh, we're going up against Air Knight. Sweet. Why is Air Knight like... Air Knight is actually two levels above me. Huh. Well then. Round four? I'm glad. Round one? Sorry. I was seeing all the battles I was doing. I was like, wait. Alright. This is going to be a little bit tough to go up against Air Knight. But uh, we're in the billionth battle stadium. Get it? I'm going to do this. Gotta go away, get the orbs, get the orbs, get, 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 oh! It's Hypersphere Clash. Even though it's Speedstorm, it's very weird. Yeah, they gotta fix that, but anyways, it's going around. There we go. Round one, easy win. Okay, round two. Let's uh, just do this. All right, there you go. Let's go around. Okay, perfect. Let's gonna get these. So we got our second point. I'm trying to think too. So I was thinking too with the three A disc, right? It's definitely not gonna create uh, the amount of impact that it should. But it's just, it's just so weird having three out of the disc, you know? I was actually thinking of doing uh, a video where I basically have the chassis discs, uh, to the original TT ones, and I just put them on like 1S or 1D. So I think it'd be funny to see. Okay, we just gotta... I don't know what it's trying to do right now. Oh no, it claimed a point! It did it! It took a point! Okay, we lost that round. Round four. Get ready. Three, two. Okay, this is gonna be the final round, so I'm not losing to Air Knight. Okay, let's uh, let's get the orbs. So this uh, goes by quickly. There you go. 
And just like that, we finished the match. Okay, so that's where we're going to be ending off this video. So I do want to say a huge thanks to Cypress. And I want to say thank you, thank you to everyone who was watching. Uh, more videos uh, coming soon. Can't wait to do them. And uh, yeah, thank you all for watching. I hope you all have an awesome and amazing Bristol day.